All right, third graders, today we're going to do Math Boxes 2.6. It's on page 44. Make sure you try most of the boxes by yourself and then just correct with me. And I'll try to go quickly so you don't get bored um, and try to show you some tricks along the way too. All right, the first thing is, is we want to write a unit in here. So you could write Mrs. Rabe's gray hair or dogs, cats, ooh, Laffy Taffy, whatever you wanted in there. All right, we're going to ex complete the fact extensions. Look at six plus seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven gets us 13. Now look at, instead of starting with six, we're gonna start with 16. We're gonna go to seven. Watch what happens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All they did from this problem to this problem is right here, they added a 10. So we know our answer is going to be 10 more than this one. We end up with 23. Now look at this one, 26. What did they do? They added two 10s. So if I started here at 26, look at the pattern. They're going to end up with 33. Okay, so here, let's just write in our answers. We know we have them. We have 23. Let's see if it will write there. Are you ready? 23, 33. Now, what did they do? Here, they added to 100. So think about that. It's still the same pattern. So we do 113. Think of the pattern. Here, they added from this extension, they added to the tens place and the ones. So instead of 136, we get 143. All right, let's go on to the next one. Fill in the blanks. Now, look where this is. What number plus nine, what number plus nine gets us to 50? Okay, look over here. Here, I'm going to turn on my highlighter again. Here is 50. Right here. Think about going and you need to know what number would you add to 9 to get to 50. Okay, well, let's just go back 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 41. Now, if I add 9 to 41, I'm going to end up with 50. So our answer is 41. It will not let me write with that. So we're just going to go here. 41. All right. 24 plus what number gets us to 30? So how many do we add to 24 to get to 30? Here's 24. Count up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. See how to do that? Now this one, it says equals. So we just want to do 70 minus 8. Put 70 in your brain. Count back eight, you get 62. Uh-oh, this one, you gotta pay attention where the equal sign is. What number plus 73 equals 80? So we're at 73 and we wanna get to 80. How many do you have to add? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can even do that. 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. I know I'm right. Always check your work. How about what time is it? Well, you're, the hour hand, the word hour is shorter than the minute. So you just look here. Okay, it always goes back. So it's five something. This one, wrong. We know that one's wrong. Okay, five something. Now let's count by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25. Not 530, not 505. D is the correct answer. This one I got rid of right away because I knew it was not six o'clock. All right, in and out. The first thing we have to do is figure out how do they get from here to here? So think about this, the number gets smaller. So we know it was subtracting. Now let's just count backwards. 117, 116, 115, 114, 113, 112. How many did they subtract? Five. Okay, so now here, 119, take away 5. 119, 118, 117, 116, 115, 114. Oh boy, now you're in the out. Remember, when you're in the out, 
opposite. O, O, out you do the opposite. So you have to actually add. So when we add 116 plus 5, we get 121. 131 plus 5, 136. Then make up your own, but be careful here. I can't put zero here because if I have zero, you can't take away five. I could put five. Uh, let's see. I could put I could put five here, and then take away five gives me zero. You see that? So be careful when you're making up your own. All right, almost done here. You're doing great. All right, I like to get my highlighter out on these ones because I highlight the important information. A vendor sells. 18 ice cream bars every day. About how many does he sell in two days? Well, how many does he sell the first day? He says every day he sells 800. So he sold 800 this day. On the next day, he also sold 800. They try to trick you by only giving you one number, but they said every day. Now we're figuring out the total. Use your number sense. This number is going to have two zeros because... We just need to do 8 plus 8. 8 plus 8 is 16. So we get 1,600. All right, we're on the last box. You need to measure that in centimeters. And when you measure that to the nearest centimeter, you hopefully got the answer 6. Thanks for following along and practice your math facts today.